Hey everybody, this is Modern Refugee, working on my second cup of coffee this morning. And uh, I showed something in one of my previous videos, um, in my chest rig video that I did a, a couple videos back. And uh, I had a commenter ask me about what it was and what was in it. So I thought I'd take a couple of minutes to show you guys uh, what that particular product is. And I'll put a link in the description for that chest rig video as well if you guys want to see the whole thing. But what I showed in my uh, chest rig is a can of provisions uh, water decon kit. And uh, I don't usually do reviews on stuff, but uh, if I think uh, something's important or it's something that I use, I will, uh, I will mention it in a video like this one here. And uh, I seen these things, I don't know, maybe a year and a half, two years ago on some other YouTube videos. Thought they were kind of interesting. Ordered one for myself to check it out and uh, kind of like it. So I ordered a couple of more and uh, kind of threw them in different packs and stuff that I got here in like that chest rig. And I'm going to read to you what's on the outside here, what it says is in this. Um, 10 water purification tablets, uh, 6 anti-diarrheal tablets, uh, 4 compressed towelettes in individual packages, 4 rubber bands, 4 alcohol wipes, 4 waterproof bandages, 2 triple antibiotic ointment packets, and 2 safety pins. Now, that doesn't sound like a lot of stuff, and these things aren't really that cheap. These were, like, when I ordered the first one, I want to say they were, like, around $20, and the second time I ordered them, they were, like, around $24, but, like, the first time I ordered it, I got, like, a code that they gave me, and uh, it knocked a couple of dollars off, paid for the shipping or whatever, and uh, kind of what these are, these are, like, a last-ditch kit if, you know, you only have a knife, a water bottle, a lighter, and this kit... You can, you know, patch yourself up a little bit. You can purify some water. And that's sort of the point of all of these uh, kits. And, uh, you know, I know they're expensive, but the packaging on this is made basically for rough handling, sort of like uh, what MRE packaging is. It's always that really heavy, tough um, mylar. And, you know, I always figure that into the cost when I'm buying something that I really think that I might have to depend on one day. I don't mind paying a little bit extra for that packing because, uh, you know, if this gets beat up, this is going to actually hold up. But I'm actually going to open this up here, dump out the uh, things that are in here, and uh, show you guys. Pull everything out of that. That's some of it. There's the rubber bands. I'm going to explain how to use these here in a uh, second. It's got a uh, little drug fact booklet that, of course, I... Uh, can just tell you kind of what stuff is in this. Don't have to read that to you. Got the safe, one of the safety pins there. These are the packets of the antibacterial ointment. These packets of antibacterial ointment, you can actually order stuff like this separately. Um, these are kind of like the ones that you'll see in like a company first aid kits. These things are actually pretty handy to have because they're so small and compact. You can throw them in stuff with a couple of band-aids. And uh, you can see kind of where I'm getting getting with stuff here uh you can probably put together a kit like this for yourself it just won't be in the the nice packaging but uh that's definitely an option as well and then those are the alcohol prep pads here are your uh aqua tabs and here are your waterproof uh, bandages your anti-diarrheal tabs which are just a modium and uh, there's the other uh, safety pin. And then here's your towelettes. I'm actually going to open one of these towelettes up and show you something why these are in there. Got a little dish of water over here. I'm going to throw these in so these can kind of reconstitute and uh, open up for me while I talk about um, the other stuff. And uh, aqua tabs are kind of good to have because these will work. You don't have the filter aspect of it. And when you're using filters like Sawyer's and stuff, you have, uh, there's a chance where they could freeze and cause problems in cold weather uh, conditions where tablets, um, even though they take a little bit longer, they're better in colder environments for um, uh, disinfecting your water, basically. So when it's cold outside, I will rely more on tablets and boiling than I do on uh on filters. Filters for me are more of a warm weather thing. And the towelettes and the rubber bands. 
Now, they're in there. Got this guy opened up here. Threw it in my dish of water. Squeeze it out a little bit. And there's my towelette that was in there. And why this is in there is it's supposed to be used in conjunction with a water bottle. So you can put that over the mouth of the water bottle with one of the heavy-duty rubber bands that they have in here. I'll show you that. Now you got a pre-filter for your water. So now you can put this into your water source, fill it up. You're going to have a pre-filter with these towelettes that are on there. And then, of course, you can add your aqua tabs into that water, close it up, give it a shake, and then let it sit for the recommended amount of time to disinfect uh, your water. And that's why those uh, towelettes like this and the rubber bands are in that particular kit. So, you know, you got your water tabs, you got a couple of band-aids that are waterproof, you got alcohol prep pads to clean something out with, you got your water purification, you got anti-diarrheal if you did get into some um, bad water. You got a couple of safety pins, you got rubber bands, you got your antibacterial ointment, again, for first aid. And they're all in this sort of heavy-duty mylar packaging so they can handle a little bit of rough handling. So it's sort of a last-ditch kit. Like I said, these are kind of expensive, so you could probably put one together um, a little bit cheaper, but you won't have that really good... Um, packaging and like I said that's kind of why I bought these is I wanted that uh, packaging to uh, stand up to a little bit of rough handling but that's basically my review here on a uh, can of provisions water decon kit so uh, that commenter knows what's in that particular kit showed you guys there if you uh, want to um, order one for yourself if you want it for a uh, really good last ditch kit uh, that's what's in it and uh, you guys know now what I know but anyways modern refugee appreciate all my subscribers out there hope you guys uh, got a little information and a little entertainment out of this video here just talking about something that I started throwing in my kits here recently you guys have a good one